Thank you, Rance. Now we are pausing for pets, and I am here with my new friend, Sam, from Jack's Humane. Now, Sam, you're new to Jack's Humane. You just took a new gig. This has to be the best day at the office all the time. It really is, yeah. Getting to bring these pets out to the community and show them off. I mean, I've been calling myself a publicist, so it's pretty great to get to show them off on the news. Well, I love that, and we are so excited to have another one of our furry friends here today. So who did you bring with you? This smiley baby. Yes, this is Pinta. She is five years old, and uh, she's been at Jack's Humane for a little bit, but I mean, she's just one of the best dogs we have. Um, super friendly, loves to run around and sit in the sunshine. She's a great girl. And now I know when people are adopting dogs, sometimes people are hesitant because they say, we don't know the dog's history and I have kids is like the number one thing that you hear. Mm -hmm. But yeah. in, in, in terms of Pinta, it sounds like that's no problem for her. Yeah, Pinta loves kids. She's actually one of our camp counselors. Um, every time we have a camp at JHS with the kiddos, Pinta will come out and hang out. She'll run around with them and play. Um, a lot of the kids will do art projects with Pinta, so they will make posters oh. and draw her pictures. If you come and see her kennel at JHS, she's got a big fan club with kids, so she would do great with a family. And in terms of other things that Penta might be great for, who do you think is her ideal family? Yeah, I think anybody who, you know, loves kisses and snuggles, she's a very gentle, sweet girl. Um, I really do think she would do great with a family with kids that she could look after and hang out with. Hey, Pinta. Look She's at all about some pets. I'm like, I'm like, show them more than, more than, the, than the back door of this yeah. doggy house. Yeah, like, she, she loves it. Um, but yes, I think she'd do great with a family with a yard where she can hang out in the sun. Awesome. And you guys have a lot of great things going on at Jack's Humane. And this time we are focusing on animals that need a little more TLC. So tell us about those animals. Yeah. So this week is Love Every Pet Week at JHS, where, like Janet said, we're spotlighting some of the animals that come to JHS needing a little extra TLC. And we're able to give them that compassionate care thanks to all of the amazing supporters we have in Jacksonville. Uh, so we have an amazing opportunity this week where if you donate to JHS for Love Every Pet Week, we are um, we have a generous donor who's matching every donation up to $40,000. Wow. So if you donate 20, it becomes 40, so on and so on. And this will help us continue to give this amazing life-saving care to these animals. I mean, and when she says life-saving, like we were talking about amputees, we were talking about dogs with cancer, like animals that wouldn't have a second chance otherwise. So you guys are making that difference. So Sam, again, with Jack's Humane, thank you so much for joining us. As always, we want to thank our friends at Forever Vets because without you, we cannot pause for pets. Mark?